President Trump's mixed messaging is increasingly throwing a curveball into negotiations on Capitol Hill, leaving lawmakers struggling to keep up with his changing opinions. The president this week reversed course on a bipartisan health care deal, first encouraging Sen. Lamar Alexander Andrew Lamar Lamar Alexander Children's Health Care Bill faces new obstacles overnight Health care Schumer calls for tying Obamacare fix to children's health insurance Puerto Rico's water woes worsen Dems plead for nursing home residents' right to sue Schumer calls for attaching Obamacare fix to children's health insurance Mora Tennessee, in private to negotiate a deal, then coming out against the agreement and seemingly stopping it cold. Sen. Ron Johnson Ronald Ron Harold Johnson Gun proposal picks up GOP support GOP lawmaker to unveil bill banning gun bump stock Senate Homeland Security Chairman backs bump stock ban after Las Vegas shootings more RWIs, asked about the president's shifting stance, said Trump would have to speak for himself because he was just trying to get results before darting into a GOP lunch. Later, as he left the meeting, Johnson was asked if Trump's comments made it harder to get results. It's always best to have a consistent message, he said. Sen. Bill Cassidy William Bill Morgan Cassidy Ben Shapiro who died and made Jimmy Kimmel Jesus Dems look to turn Obamacare tables on GOP in 18 Congress misses deadline to reauthorize children's health care program more RLA, noted he had an extremely good working relationship with the White House on his proposal to overhaul Obamacare by turning its subsidies and Medicaid expansion into block grants for states, but he also said it was easier to have everyone on the same page obviously you want your side to know exactly what you can give and not give, right he said. It was just the latest example in what's become a familiar cycle on Capitol Hill senators believe they and Trump are on the same page, only to find out, sometimes hours later and frequently through tweets, that the president has changed his mind. After throwing a celebration on the White House lawn after the House approved its Obamacare repeal bill, Trump weeks later called the legislation mean. Graham, asked at the time about the comments, said, If you're looking for political cover from the White House, I'm not sure they're going to give it to you. Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell Addison Mitch Mitchell McConnell Gun proposal picks up GOP support children's health care bill faces new obstacles to see Trump as potential ally on gun reform more RKY and House Speaker Paul Ryan Paul Ryan Hill interview budget chair Black sticks around for now gun proposal picks up GOP support GOP lawmaker Tim Murphy to retire at end of term more RWIs were left flat-footed when Trump agreed with Democrats on a three-month government funding and debt ceiling deal in September, even though GOP leadership wanted a longer 18-month agreement. Trump has also shifted and shifted again in his message on the Obama era, the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals DACA program shielding certain young immigrants from deportation, frustrating Democrats. Senate Minority Leader Charles Schumer Charles Chuck Ellis Schumer of Unite Healthcare Schumer calls for tying Obamacare fix to children's health insurance Puerto Rico's water woes worsen Dems plead for nursing home residents' right to sue crying on TV doesn't qualify Kimmel to set nation's gun agenda Trump knocks fake news coverage of his trip to Puerto Rico more DN, Y, and House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi D. Kaloff claimed a victory last month after a closed-door meeting at the White House Congress top Democrats believe they had gotten the president to agree to work on a deal that would attach a DACA fix to border security, but not funding for Trump's wall on the southern border. Instead, the administration released a seven-page list of immigration principles that demanded funding for the U.S.-Mexico border wall, as well as more resources to catch individuals residing in the country illegally, and a merit-based system that would overhaul the green card program and limit so-called chain migration. Schumer, referring to the demands as Trump's list of horribles, labeled the president the obstructionist-in-chief. He's the obstructionist-in-chief because he can't stick to a position, Schumer told reporters, in one of several speeches this week knocking Trump for flip-flopping. This president cannot govern if, whenever the hard right frightens him and says jump, he says how high, Republicans are publicly much less critical of Trump's curveballs, even as they acknowledge hearing different things. Asked how leadership could get members to buy into negotiations if Trump was going to reverse his position, Senate Majority Whip John Cornyn John Cornyn gun proposal picks up GOP support House bill set to reignite debate on warrantless surveillance Republicans jockey for position on immigration more R. Texas said that the president's expressed himself in different ways at different times, so I'm not sure exactly sure what the White House position is on the deal Alexander, the chairman of the Senate Health Committee, negotiated with Sen. 
Patty Murray, Patricia Patty, Lynn Murray, Children's Healthcare Bill faces new obstacles overnight. Healthcare Schumer calls for tying Obamacare fix to children's health insurance. Puerto Rico's water woes worsen. Dems plead for nursing home residents' right to sue. Schumer calls for attaching Obamacare fix to children's health insurance. More washed the panel's ranking Democrat. The struggle for both ends of Capitol Hill to get on the same page comes days after Trump and McConnell held an impromptu press conference in the Rose Garden aimed at stressing they were working together. With the first unified government in a decade, Republicans are struggling to score legislative victories amid growing frustration from their conservative base. Trump is increasingly kicking major issues to Congress, setting up a legislative cliff at the end of the year that could include the government shutdown, a push to crack down on Iran and lingering battles over health care and immigration. The more standard route is for the administration to lay out, for instance on health care, a series of bullet points at the minimum, or a full bill. That's typically the way things would work. So, yeah, it's a very different way of governing and I think it's one of the reasons you've seen the results to be what they are, Sen. Bob Corker Robert Bob Phillips Corker Deficit Hawks Voice Worry Over Direction of Tax Plan The Hill Interview Budget Chair Black Sticks Around For Now Overnight Finance White House Requests B For Disaster Relief Exequifax Chief Grilled Over Stock Sales House Panel Approves B For Border Wall Tax Plan Puts Swing State Republicans In Tough Spot More Are Tennessee, told the Associated Press. Trump frequently weighs in on the Senate's rules on social media, often urging McConnell to get rid of the 60-vote filibuster. An HES shown that he will pass the blame to lawmakers when the party ISNT able to make good on major campaign promises. We're not getting the job done, and I'm not going to blame myself. I'll be honest, they are not getting the job done, Trump said this week.